So guys, welcome to the Rains African Experiences and yeah, <laughs> this video is basically uh, something of mine. I'm going to show you, well, these young men are going to show us how sugar canes are planted. Uh, first of all, there are two types of sugar canes in Uganda. We have the red sugar canes. And then we have the green ones and then we have the extremely small ones that you can barely bite that I've seen Skull. Skull uses them to make sugar. So this is a huge place and a lot of farming is taking place on this area. You know, so most of it is a little bit scattered. <sighs> but yeah, there is a lot of sugar cans all the way down. And I should have had boats coming here. So this is a wet place. You can easily, well, step in a wrong place and sink in. Water, I should have had boats. Boats. I swear to God, if I drown, ow, my shoes. Ow. For the love of content. Oh. <laughs> okay content creation is no joke okay well not all content some of it okay, jump, yeah. i guess at this point i'm just gonna go bare feet <sighs> more water jump, jump. No, don't jump. You can step there. well i hope i don't sink oh my god let's see you can jump on tv okay there. thank you Oh yeah, this is maize. This was maize. It's dried out. Yeah. Ooh. All right, so I'm not oh, going any further into the bush. Like I'm just gonna show you, hopefully. Oh my goodness, this place is huge. You know, it goes all the way, literally all the way. So let's just study and learn a little bit about how to grow these. And uh, this young man is going to be kind enough to take us through, you know, because this is their plantation. And I'm sure they've learned plenty from their dad, teaching them how to farm. You know, these are skills that you teach kids at a young age, but they pay off later. Do you know how much a sugar can cost in Uganda? Something this, this small is going for at least 1,000 shillings. That's a lot of money, you know, that's a lot of money. So he's going to tell us how long they grow for, what they plant, you know, and is it profitable? Is it something that's profitable? You know, let's find out. So uh, to the camera, back to him. Hey guys, my name is uh, Sultan Barak. So I'm going to tell you more about the sugarcane plantation around here. My dad is on this place, you know, uh, in most times. The sugar cane is taking something like one year to grow. It takes one year to grow. Uh, and the sugar cane needs like areas with water. That's why most people are planting sugar cane. Are planting areas with water. Even you see that the trenches, they're containing in water, you know. Most areas they need water. The sugar cane, you can dry a sugar cane in dry place and you get a big yield. So, a sugar cane, when you're harvesting it, you're like, you're breaking it from down, you know. So like you're harvesting this part. See you harvest it. So in most cases you're breaking the the, the stem you're going to eat. This is the main part they eating, you know. So this part, this one here. In most villages, they are planting this one. They are planting this part. You see? It's the one that is germinating into a... Uh, like a plant. It's germinating into this, you know? But even... Even if you're not planting this one, in most cases, people who are planting sugar canes. After breaking the sugar cane, it's got like some... I think it's called the bud, you know? I'll show you the bud. Uh-huh. Careful. 
I left my panga there, so I, I might. Yeah, we forgot the panga. We should have but come with it. Pain. So you were planting, you put this part all in soil, you know? This part, the bud is germinating, it can germinate, you know? And the rest is rotting, this one's got to rot and it's forming the roots, you know? You know what I'm saying? So, most cases, a sugar cane uh, in Uganda is a lot of money. It's like we are now having here area of four, four acres of sugar cane because we are having other, other plants, but mainly we are planting sugar cane because we are in water areas, you know? As you can see here, there's water. Almost all over the area there is water, you see? Trenches there is water. So, a sugar cane is costing 1,000 shillings in Uganda. The smallest one. The smallest, now you are like... Let me show you here. <laughs> like this one. This one to this one. Now this one is costing 1,000. <laughs> This one, this this size, is costing one thousand shillings. You're getting it at one thousand shillings in the market of Uganda right now. You did uh, due to fuel increases in prices, so the sugar cane's growing more expensive because they're mainly grown in villages. They are not seen in town, you know. So a sugar cane takes one year to grow in actual sense. A sugar cane needs water, needs water area to grow, and uh, a sugar cane. If you are like to harvest the sugar cane in most cases you're using a panga and the, this is what most cases we call the seed. In, in uh, Uganda they, they are calling it a, a seed. You know? They're planting this one. This top one. They plant it from here, they plant this one into the soil, you know. Now I want to show you a young sugar cane, a very young one here. Before I bring in at least this this top one. Because now, now this one. You see this sugar? That's before the before it's producing the what we eat it first it's still covered with the with the leaves you know so the the more it germinates these down ones i when it's growing big they are they are what they're drying up and falling down you know but the longer the sugar cane down because most cases the down part is sweet than the top part you know the top part is not the sweeter like this one because even i can give you and you have a taste but yeah, it's still later. This top, this down one is more sweet than the top one, you know? Yeah. So I think that's all we need to know about the sugar. Yeah, and from from some knowledge that I got, uh, sugar canes basically, they, if, you pr if you plant them in an area, well, actually it's not just sugar cane, most foods, they're only as sweet as their soil. It's so weird, but it's true. The better the soil pH, yes. the sweeter, the product. In fact, the more leveled, the more everything, the more nutrients you give it. And sugar canes are one of those foods that no, don't... You see even the soil, eh? the soil is fertile, you know? It's very black. It's black. It's having a lot of humus. Due to these other plants you are growing after harvesting, we are like throwing them down and they rot. The leaves rot and they're forming the, the manure, you know? So you see what he's saying, he's pro they're providing natural fertilizers to their sugar cans. They're not spraying with any kind of pesticides, which means these sugar cans are actually very, very healthy. You know, they're, they're, there is nothing else added to it. I was having another question. You have another question you can ask. Hmm, we'll see. Let's keep going. But yeah, I really wish I could go further in because the place is so, so big, you know. There are so many sugar cans, to be honest. It goes all the way, literally all the way up to that eucalyptus. All the way back. And this is me zooming in. It's crazy. They are huge. You know? Making some big money. And agriculture in general, man. These days, agriculture, whatever you grow, whatever you grow, it comes with a lot of money, you know? So much money in agriculture. Man, it's crazy. Some crazy ass shit is going on in this country. Farmers are to be probably the most rich people coming up this year. 
They are becoming the richest people right, so, so fast again, and so quickly. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, and share. Yeah, let's learn. I learned something today. I hope you did too. Yeah, thank you. So do you remember my, one of my goats to give birth? That's a baby. This is a bonus video. I hope you enjoy watching this little wee goat enjoying its new life. It's only two weeks old. They're a little bit far from me, but I still uh, keep track of what's going on with them. Yeah, shit. You give birth to a boy, a big boy. He's a crossbreed. He's gonna be huge, very huge, you know? Yeah, thanks for watching, yeah? Subscribe, like, and share. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Hi, God. <laughs> yep.